in just few seconds and with an amazing and a totally free app i moved this mr beast picture from this to this without paying a dime without even the watermark of the software of the app being left on the image like this is absolutely free in fact it also gives you the opportunity to edit the remover of the background you can decide to customize the remover to your taste and this is so unusual and that is why i've decided to share the process with you share the app with you and show you exactly how you can do the same to any and every of your images i will see you right in the video all right so the first thing is to um get the app the name of the app is CapCut. so that, that is the app that we are working with CapCut. okay it's actually a very popular app so i know you should know about it now the next thing is you probably come across um the interface as this if you've not updated your CapCut app ensure that you do that ensure that you update your CapCut app then after updating the cap cut app the next thing is you you will see something like this you should see something like this on your app interface when you open the app now the next thing is to click on this right click on this expand just tap on expand and then you will see some other things now about these other features here if you want me to create videos on each and every of these features or at least on um a good number of these features here like if you want me to create specific videos on them let me know in the comment section just type i want do that right now type i want in the comment section also use this opportunity to hit the subscribe button if you are new to this channel and hit the like button so that youtube can recommend this video to more people right so do that right away drop i want in the comment if you want specific videos on each of this all right i believe you've done that already now we have a lot of features here but then we have um remove background right we have remove background here and this is the feature we want to work with so just tap on remove background and then from there you will be allowed to select your image i am using mr beast image for the sake of this tutorial so this is the image that i'm working with and i'm going to click on add all right now immediately you add it the ai will begin to work automatically like you can see on my screen now it has removed the background oh i know that you can see the, see the background but then just pay attention to my cursor at this point pay attention to my cursor if you tap on this you can see that the background is gone now i want to take you through some of these other features here that you can play around with you know i said that you can actually manually customize the um let's assume that while the ai the cap code ai was trying to remove the background of the subject there was a mistake and it missed some you can edit it you can actually um work on those parts i mean manually and that is why if you look at this you will see something like manual select right manual select which is already selected immediately the um the main focus here was auto select can you see look at it look at auto select here let me reset it so that you can understand so look at the set i will reset it and this is the original image right this is the original image so this is auto select i'm going to click on auto select and you can see that it has taken us back to where it was so once you click on your image like i did earlier it that auto select feature automatically works but if you do not want it you can actually click on reset here and it's going to reset your image where you can begin to work on it afraid let's assume that you want to use manual select you can actually do that here you can just select can you see i'm manually selecting it tap on this look at before can you see look after look at before look after now there's also quick select so um quick select look at it quick select also um works like manual select just that this time around let me reset it and show you how quick select works. this is quick select so if you click on this quick select you can increase the size or reduce the size whatever size you are, you are actually going to use depends on the image you are working with for example now this image if i make the size this big i am making a mistake because this is going to no matter how i tap it it's going to touch on the background which is not going to allow the app to to effectively remove the background let me show you what i'm talking about if i tap on this 
all right let's wait for it can you see it has selected part of the background so even if i click on this can you see that this has actually defiled the objective of removing the background so that is why you need to be careful so if you're using mana select you can reduce the size to at least this then you can begin to tap on it can you see can you, you can begin to tap on it one after um gradually and gradually but even this um this is not going to be really this is not going to be you can undo and this is redo undo so you can actually okay i made a mistake there you can zoom in your work right undo you can always zoom in your work all right you can actually do that gradually can you see so let's assume that you even use the auto select and you realize that um the auto select did not do the work effectively let's assume that maybe the auto select me some parts you can actually use this to um you can actually use this to um select manually those parts that the auto select missed and that is the amazing thing about this i mean that is the amazing thing about CapCut and the background removing feature so i made a mistake there i'll need to reduce the size some more and then okay, i still made the mistake again i still made a mistake again undo you can zoom in and then all right can you see manually selected but i feel like this is actually a long process when you can just use the auto select then you can now use your quick select to for correctional purposes i mean to correct let's say the auto select me some part now there's also also the eraser part so let's assume that i like i tap this now i basically can you see oh this is too much for this can you see yeah let's assume i made this kind of mistake or let's assume my auto select also do something like this you can tap on your eraser and then you just erase it now for the eraser and this also applies to the manual select right for the manual select and for the eraser you can actually adjust the hardness you can adjust the opacity you can also adjust the size so for this let me adjust my size to this i'm not going to touch on this under manual select because they work the same way basically so this hardness what it means is that it's just talking about um feather yeah it just it works like feather so let me show you what it does if i tap on this now let me increase my size okay this is eraser right let's click on manual select if i tap on this can you see can you see how sharp the um ends are or the edges let me just use edges now if i reduce the hardness if i reduce the hardness to the lowest can you see how it looks like can you see the difference please pay attention look at it can you see the difference this is actually like the edges of this the edges of this are actually less sharper than this can you see so that is one thing you need to take note about this the same thing also applies to the eraser so um look at it okay my opacity i think i need to increase my i need to reduce the opacity to one um okay so there is rather can you see it can you see how, how sharp the edges are but then let me undo it and then let me reduce the hardness to one and then you will see can you see can you see so that is the beauty of this i mean that is the beauty a beauty of that hardness feature so you can also adjust your size and with this you can actually um erase um you can erase you can actually erase it or uh, let me increase the hardness can you see you can actually take your time zoom in if you need to zoom in and erase it carefully 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 all right so by all of this all of this i will actually recommend that you first use the auto um select so let me reset it and then select my auto select again so for getting my auto select now it has selected everything perfectly can you see but then if it made a mistake oh sorry do if it made a mistake um i can easily adjust it myself manually so that's how amazing it is now look at our before now look at our before look at our after the background is now removed now cap code also give you the opportunity to do some other things and then you can click on background and from here even change the color of the background to whatever color you want can you see you can change to whatever color you want i mean this or this all these options here so like look at red look at this look at yellow look at this look at all of this amazing color i mean that you can always use so um 
that but then if you want it just like this you can also do that now there is also another feature here to edit more this allow you to edit your text more and um from here you can edit the color um the size and um all the all of those amazing things here let me know if you want a tutorial um on this let me know if you want it to trust specifically on this but then we are done removing the background which is what this video is about now what is the next thing the next thing is to export and then you can do that from here right and then our image has exported so um we can actually go and check out our image and um see it can you see the background has been removed right look at the background has been removed the background has been removed let me take for example let me import it into my um into my pixel lab app okay this is the original image but that is not what i want um recent yeah look at it it no longer has any background and yeah i can use it for my design or whatever i want to use it for so that is how to remove the background of images for free like you can see here now there is no watermark i mean look at there is no watermark at all and that's the amazing thing about using CapCut to remove your background thank you for watching up to this point let me know if you got value from this video in the comment section give this video a like if you haven't done that also subscribe and turn on your notification bell button so that you do not miss my next content it is very very important also share this video with at least one person i mean you are going to be helping them big time i will see you in the next video peace out